Shalom fam, it's that biblical babe Jelly B. Back again, I got a message, a lovely message for somebody, a good message for somebody. And I just want to speak this because this is the confirmation that the Father gave me that somebody's going to receive. You're going to see if this message is for you or you will have already been seeing the numbers 311, 311. And that relates to the book of Ruth. Yes, I was thinking, is it the book of Ruth? Ruth and Boaz. It is the book of Ruth, right? And that scripture, it reads, And now, my daughter, fear not. I will do to thee all thou has, thou requirest. This is the King James, no, no, King James Version. For all of the city of my people know that you are a virtuous woman. This message, and it doesn't have to just be for a woman. I'm going to tell you what where this message comes from. It's from a vision, right? But this is the confirmation the Holy Spirit spoke to me. Whoever this is for, you've already been seeing the numbers 311, or you're going to be seeing this. Or this relates to a person, if you're not a female, this is what's uh, taken place in your life, in that you've been a bit like Ruth whether you're male or female, you've been in a position of servitude. You've just been serving, serving, serving. And the Father has brought you to places, to people, for you to just serve them and not get anything in return for your servitude. And it was really changing your heart because this is what he wanted to do. He wanted to change and don't leave yet, okay? Because I haven't told you the vision and you're going to want to know this, whoever this is for, but yeah. He put you in a position to serve other people, to put you, he put you places where it's like, you got nothing out of it, but just the gratitude that you can give to the father to know that I can be of service to someone else, that somebody else can thank you because I'm here to serve them. That's what he did. And what it was, was to change the desires of your heart. It's deep. Oh, I still haven't got there, so chill. He was changing the desires of your heart, Ruth. Maybe you're, you're not Ruth, but you're the male version of Ruth. Rufus. I don't like that name, but Rufus. Right. Maybe you are a Rufus. Yeah? The Lord has got plans for you. He was changing your heart's desires. Do you know why? This is what he showed me this morning. As I woke up, I was awake and I had this vision. I saw somebody's mobile banking app and it had an amount, £869 in the account. So, of course, gotta hit up my Google, do a 869 Strong's Concordance, of a and then I checked it and it says, suddenly, like an earthquake, the scriptures that it relates to is in Acts, that people are going to know it was God. Somebody's going to experience a financial blessing and it's going to be suddenly. And the thing is, the father's done it in this way where he made you go and serve Ruth or Rufus. Go and serve everybody because of what you're going to do with the finances that he's going to bless you with. This overflow, this abundance, this suddenly in your finances is to be a blessing like you've already become. He's amazing. He's strategic. He's got his hands all over your life. Remember that. But yeah, whoever this is for, I receive it because I pray this me, Lord. I want to receive the financial blessings. Why not? I receive it in Jesus' name. And I pray if this is for you, you receive it too. I pray, Lord, that you give us the sound wisdom to be good stewards over what you are blessing us with in Jesus' name. Give us not just the wisdom, Lord, the sound wisdom that is promised to the righteous. Give us the understanding and the knowledge and connect us with knowledge so we shall not perish. We shall not serve other gods or things that you have not destined for us to, to do or to serve, Lord. Lord, help us to be good servants and stewards over what you are giving us in Jesus name. But whoever this message is for, I pray it finds them and that, yeah, praise the Lord. He made you serve others. Thank you for your heart. I want to say that because it's rare to find people who are just, who just want to help people who will do something for nothing, you know? So big up yourself. But anyway, that's the message. I'll speak to you guys soon. I love you.
thank you for loving on me always i love you guys i'm gonna go finish painting my nails check out my website right biblicalbabe.com it's up and running i just did my sister's hair today it was her prom so check out the style i'm gonna try and add it at the end of this video you can book me biblicalbabe.com for your nails your lashes and your hair oh i'm joking but yeah love you guys i'll speak to you soon shalom